Hey everybody, it's uh, it's about 4 o'clock on a Monday afternoon, uh, another hot, steamy, sticky day. Uh, unlike the last couple reviews, I'm going to do, uh, do a beer that's more suited to the weather, and uh, believe it or not, it's one I've never had before. Uh, I'm going to do the Polliner Hefeweizen. I do like Hefeweizens. Uh, it's their Hefeweizen Natural Wheat. Uh, went to the website, it says, The Polliner Hefeweizen Natural Cloudy Beer is our brewery's best-selling product. Specifically cultivated, top-fermented yeast give it its unmistakable character. Sparkling, mild, and fruity with a delicate yeast flavor. The eye is immediately drawn to its gleaming orange color, its uniform cloudiness, and the large head. The unfiltered brewing method allows it to retain its natural authenticity along with the many vitamins, minerals, and trace elements. So it's healthy too. Comes in at 5.5% ABV. Uh, let me get this, uh, get this polliner in this glass. I decided I actually brought a Hefeweizen glass today. I don't think I did the last one justice. A little bit of smoke off the glass. Let me get this poured. Got a big glass, so I'm using my Ironger glass today. I'm going to just pour it all. Get it down there and, well, I mean, with this head, I may not be able to, but I'm going to swirl up the yeast. I love the yeast in this. Give it a good pour. Really nice. Oh, perfect, perfect, almost perfect pour. Uh, we got a cloudy orange body, bunch of carbonation streaming up. Uh, got good, at least three fingers, three and a half fingers of a nice, thick, creamy, uh, eggshell colored head. Just really, really classic looking, uh, classic looking Hefeweizen. So, see if I can get through this head and give it a nose. Oh yeah, it's um, it's citrusy, orange, lemon peel, a few floral notes. Um, definitely getting that yeast, those yeast notes, some light fruits, um, cloves, um, coriander. Just really, really nice, uh, really nice smelling, classic smelling uh, hefeweizen. So let's give it a taste. Somewhere under that head is some beer. Yeah, you're getting a, definitely getting a banana. I didn't get, yeah, now, now that I think about it, yeah, there's a light banana on the nose, but it's a lot stronger on the taste. Um, got your mild fruit, your citrus, um, cloves, coriander, lots of wheat. Definitely banana. Good, good taste in, uh, again, classic Hefeweizen. Nothing, nothing outstanding so far. It's um, light to medium light bodied. Uh, definitely got some serious carbonation on it. Um, really light, frothy, really refreshing beer. Um, so uh, let me uh, sit, sip on this a while. It's not going to be too long. It's not one I want to let warm up too much and uh, I'll come back after a while with the final thoughts and grade. Okay, I'm back. It's been oh, maybe 10 minutes or so. This hadn't warmed up a lot. As you can see, it's it's mostly gone. I mean, this is a very refreshing, uh, drinkable beer. Perfect for a for a hot, sticky day like this. Um, my only my only uh, problem with it is it's it's way too typical. Um, There's nothing discernible here that makes it stand out really from any other Hefeweizen. I mean, it's better than, than a lot I've had, especially some American versions, but uh, definitely not a Weihestefaner, not even a, not even close, um, not close to even that Hacker Shore I had the other day, which was, which was damn good, but um, still a pleasant, all a somewhat underwhelming beer. Um, it's not terrible. It's just, just not great. Um, 
So I'm going to give the the Polliner Hefeweizen Natural Wheat, or as they say on their website, their Natural Cloudy Beer. I'm going to give it a good solid uh, 7.5 out of 10. I mean, it's it's not a, that expensive. It's a easily drinkable beer. As you can see, it's mostly gone. And for the first time in a long time, I'm going to do a final chug. So, uh, 7.5 out of 10. Till next time, everybody. Cheers. Let's keep drinking good beers. It did leave some nice and icing down the glass, so that's for sure. I'll give it that. Next time.